how we produced and how I A&R'd a Billy um, by Earth Game featuring Future. So my producer, Carvello, sent me this beat, Crazy Beat, which was the early stages to a Billy. Heard the beat, fire, so I started doing some production changes to it. Kind of playing with the arrangement, just making it more full and more polished. I had been working with Earth Gang at that point for like a couple months. So I had Earth Gang come to the studio with me and Carvello. And that night, man, them boys are crazy talented, amazing artists. They cut five songs in one night, like no cap. I'm talking about verse, hook, verse, hook, song done in like five hours. So the first song we worked on happened to be the early stages to a Billy. We had pulled the beat up. They caught a vibe to it. And I think Wild Great jumped on the mic and started freestyling that hook instantly. And just, I kind of looked at old Lou and I was like, yo, I think that's the vibe. And it was just something that was just super, you know, catchy, super like great potential for a hook. Anyway, the song got done, some months passed. We had a couple tracks with them. Everything was coming out crazy. And then old Lou hit me recently and was like, yo, song is coming out, it's a vibe, but guess what? And I was like, what? He's like, yo, we got a super dope feature on it. And I was like, who? And he was like, future. I was like, whoa, that's crazy. I never would imagine Earth Gang and Future. Songs came out super dope. Then they reached out to Tane to add some um, additional production on the beat switch, came out super dope. Yeah, so that's how I ate all that record. A Billy, Earth Gang featuring Future, produced by Carvello, me, Tane. Crazy record, super catchy. Go check it out.